Hey everyone, this is Melanie. Welcome to my video for Bramble Fox. I will be using the new Christmas perspectives and I'm going to be using the Fala La La La. And I'm going to also be using the Simple Stories Mix and Mingle. Here I'm just going to show you what's in the package of this set that's in the shop. There's several perspectives and a beautiful um, bluish green and a deep red. They have magical, fa la la, ho ho ho, and twinkle. So that's a set of four that comes in this pack of perspectives. And today I'm going to be using, like I said, the Simple Stories Mix and Mingle. I'm going to start by putting some Distress Oxides on the back of my paper. I'll be using four colors. I'm going to start with Spun Sugar and then Evergreen Bow. I'm just applying water. The next is the new Lumberjack Plaid. And lastly, I will add the darker green in a second, and that's gonna be Pine Needles. I did put the water on and dried between each one with my brush, um, not with my brush, with my heat tool. So we've got all those colors on the back, and I've got three pictures that I'm gonna use. I'm gonna pull out the small paper pad and pick some of the pattern papers to go behind that. I tried to use that little string of lights, but it just didn't work on the bottom there. I am gonna take, after I get my picture situated, it took me a minute, I'm gonna start pulling the back off of the perspective and use some wet glue to hold it down, especially because it's on the mixed media, I wanna hold it down really well and let it attach. Now I'm just gonna go through the ephemera pack. I have pulled out this little piece. It's like almost like a little piece of garland. I put some powder on the back of it to take the sticky off because I wanted to put pop dots and pop it up. I'm going to put it under the title. Here I'm just going through some of the cardstock stickers and some of the chipboard. I'm going to add some presents just around the title because it was just kind of empty looking there. So I'm going to add these cute little presents, pop them up with pop dots. I fussy cut out this word that says Christmas time. I'm going to add that on a pop dot up around that little set of poinsettias right there. And I can't remember what I add next. Let me see what we're doing next. I've already forgotten. Oh, I've got that little, um, I took my We Are Memory Keepers punch and punched out some tabs out of some of the pattern paper that was left over. There I'm putting little words to the left. It says family and the word to the top says tis the season. I'm going to add some little clusters of mistletoe. Now I'm just going to add in some little sequins. I've been really into sequins lately. So I just pulled out some sequin mixes with just out of a pinkish red and like that lightish light blue green color. And I do three sequins in three different places. Then I'm going to take out some of my Heidi Swap stamps. I'm going to start with the evergreen bow and I'm going to type the word December on that little tag. And I'm going to add a little 25 underneath it just in some black. And then I'm going to do a little more tone-on-tone -tone stamping with some more of the Heidi Swap stamps once I get that down. And I pop that up on some foam dots as well, just to give, you know, all about the dimension. Next, I'm going to pull out the plaid, lumberjack plaid, and I'm going to do under that picture, it says Very Merry and another Heidi Swap stamp. These are just some of her Christmas caption stamps. Then I'm going to take the green again and do Happy Everything at the top right of that picture. I just love the little fonts that she has. Now I'm just taking, this is from the Vicki Booten, is it Warm Wishes? Yeah, Vicki Booten Warm Wishes, and it's just these little asterisk kind of star looking things, and I'm just going to add those in a couple of places, just because I had the black in the stamp, and I'm going to put the date in black. Now I decided that the top was a little too empty, so I'm going to cut a V in the top and then just add a little bit of a green pattern paper that was the back side that I backed one of the pictures with. So I'm going to add that there. I kind of pulled the edges and distressed them. I'm going to add a little mistletoe, a star, and a little word that says, oh by golly. Now what you're going to, not going to see is I did off camera sew around the edges and you'll be able to see that in the final picture. Um, here I'm going to add the little red star just because, you know, I always feel like you need threes. So I will, before I finish um, off camera, sew 
and just kind of that greenish evergreen bow color green all around the edges and there you have it I have it finished I hope you've enjoyed this live. I would love for you to stop by the Bramble Fox store and check out all the holiday goodies and Fox Box that we have in. You can also follow me on Instagram and YouTube at Melanie Hyatt. Be sure and follow us on Facebook and Instagram for Bramble Fox, and I will see you in the next video.